Hello everybody and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included Spaced Out Edition here on our DC Colony where our superheroes are going to forever go to space. Well, okay, maybe not forever, but they're in space already, so maybe that's not quite accurate. <laughs> Uh-oh, oh, don't worry, poor Hatch. We will get you shortly. Here, in fact, I'll tag you for wrangling, although we don't have anybody that can actually wrangle you yet, but we'll pretend that we do. Do we have any high temperature plants yet? Not yet. No joys. No joyous seeds. All right. Of course, here we go. You know, I just take nice drinks and everything before we start the video. And what do I do? I start start the video and start coughing. I'm, I'm doomed. Aha! Uh, all right. Well, anyways, you guys are used to it by now. <laughs> Probably all think, man, he's always sick. Not healthy. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. I've been, uh, old age has not been kind. I mean, I say old age, but I'm not old. I mean, I'm 47, you know, so that's not old at all. Not really. Oh my god. Half my life left. More than half. Plan to live to 100 at minimum. If I'm, if technology allows, I'd like to go longer than that. <laughs> all right, um, let's continue. No, yeah, continue to do this we're blocking this stuff off uh we're almost done with this one in fact we can go a little bit further here not digging out the bottom yet because i want to reach the top so we'll just do that <clears throat> we're kind of not <clears throat> doing a whole lot like i paused the research and all of that because i'm trying to get the dupes to just finish some stuff like clean up but we have skills all right let me see so we got crop tending we've got our carrying so we can get you the advanced so you are faster you are the ultimate farmer batwoman oh superman all right you're already super carrying and super plumbing there's really nothing else to give you honestly um i mean if i was to give you anything at all you have no interest anywhere else <clears throat> i mean i'll give him construction so if he does build something at least he's not too slow right wonder woman all right you've got all the way up to demolition we just need to get you carrying <coughs> there you go awesome you can construct and deconstruct and demolish all you want. Wonder Woman's actually good at demolishing. Most superheroes are very good at demolishing. It makes you wonder when you watch those, watch the shows, the comics, the movies, you know, all that games. <clears throat> you got these superheroes, you know, saving the world, saving people. But they're always destroying everything. <clears throat> so... Now, they did address this slightly, I saw, in one of the movies for Marvels with Iron Man, <clears throat> where, like, when he was fighting the Hulk, you know, the Sokovia one, um, there was a building under construction, and he basically said, oh, buy that building, you know, and he caused the building to crash down onto Hulk. That, of course, a whole building coming down is going to cause damage to all of the other buildings around it, vehicles, other things, potentially people. <clears throat> Who pays for all that? <clears throat> Who's responsible? You know, outside of a couple of the superheroes, like Batman and Iron Man, most of them are not, like, super rich billionaires. <clears throat> right? So, who... <clears throat> Who's... <clears throat> if I can't talk. Who's paying for that damage? And then, also... Um, what happens if people die because of what they do? You know, they're fighting, they smash the bad guy into a building, and uh, the building collapses, and people die in the building. Uh, shouldn't they be responsible? I mean, or are they just blaming the bad guy? Saying, well, you know, it's the bad guy. It's his fault. So, you know. <clears throat> really makes you question things, doesn't it? from a superhero standpoint. All right, 
Let's see here. <laughs> well, we're going to start... Well, no, we can't give them sedimentary rock because if we give them sedimentary rock, they'll morph. <laughs> we don't need any of the others. We're just going to keep them as is. So sandstone it is. Later, I think we can give them some food and stuff because we'll have enough to, get, to feed them food. Even feed them themselves meat. So we'll do that. Um, okay, we gotta do hatchlings too. All right, it's already selected. Excellent. All right, and then so that means we just need raw mi raw minerals, sandstone. There we go. Cool. I could morph them to stone hatches because then we can have a mix of stone and later on because then you can feed them obsidian and things like that that you just don't use very much for anything else all right cool so we got our hatch farm slightly up and running <clears throat> the hatch we have is on the wrong side <clears throat> he's over here so we're gonna have to grab him as well at some point and transport him over the through the door um but we'll get there. We don't have anybody to wrangle these guys yet, so... Too bad they don't eat seeds. I mean, of course, you can have fish farm and they eat the seeds, but... It would be handy if hatches ate seeds as well. Come here, you too. <coughs> Alright, that's enough hatches we can get all into the farm. As soon as we have the capability. And we have a couple eggs around too. Hey, we can get more hatches. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> we'll take the sand for now. We're not expanding yet. Oh, it looks like we got our electrical up. Let's snip. There we go. <clears throat> that means the entertainment room is usable. <clears throat> that is awesome. We're going to... Prioritize just these really quick so that they can just get it done. Um, and then that way we can finish clearing out the room here. <clears throat> there we go. So basically that means we can deconstruct all of these. Cool. Alright, looking good. <clears throat> How's our cleanup looking? Clean, 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 clean. Almost completely clean. Doesn't look like there's anything to clean there. <clears throat> that is really good. Let's go ahead and clean this and this portion. And then we can start working on <clears throat> cleaning up the farms and stuff. Um, we'll start with the hatch farm here. And this one. I'm not putting it on high priority. I'm just putting it on the low priority. <clears throat> but we'll start, you know, if they have nothing else to do, they could pick something up and take it to storage. Speaking of, we're going to need more storage. Um, actually, I really don't want these up here because if ever I put... Well, no, it's fine. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and do that. All right, cool. Let me see. They probably can't reach any of this. But we can reach that one. I don't know. We'll, we'll try to reach these. We'll see. If they stand here, he might be able to get that one. I just don't think he can get that one. We'd have to build a ladder to get across here. Which I'll go ahead and do. Just so that we can clean this out. The goal is to get all the slime out of here. So, Of course, getting the germs out is going to be another thing. But we'll get there. At least we're putting slime lung in, slime in these. Not much. Most of it's just sitting around up here. But yeah, see, so he got the oh, he did he he got the lower one, but not the top one. Okay, <clears throat> and we can get that. 
Okay, now if you're really smart. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Get that much at least. <clears throat> Alright, so we are in here. You guys did get this. <clears throat> There's only polluted oxygen there. So we can do that. Let's go ahead and continue to get this out, and then we need to do the same here. So we'll get, we'll do that one as well. And then we'll need to do the same thing so we can expand this room over. So, all right, cool. Uh, and then we're going to have to kitty corner these over as well so that we can slowly get in here. All right, I think we're good to start up our research again. So it's going to be our other science. There we are. We'll go ahead and get that done. <clears throat> Not worried about oxygen systems or anything like that because we have tons of algae still. So we're just going to keep running these oxygen diffusers um, <coughs> and these two little ter terrariums. There we go, we'll get that one. And I think we're good. Let me see, we're getting more and more mushrooms. That is good. Still got a little ways to go, but uh, they are gro growing and expanding. How are we doing up here? <clears throat> oh. <laughs> we accidentally broke through and dumped all of this down here. Well, I mean, that's not terrible, but okay. <laughs> Whoops. We weren't supposed to do that. In fact, I don't know why we didn't tag that for building. That would probably explain a lot. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll go ahead and uh, <clears throat> get that built and then finish that. I mean, this isn't terrible. It just means we need to pump it out. Which isn't a problem because we do have a thing right there uh, let's go ahead and start running the power over here um, we'll start there now where are we taking this <clears throat> it's a cooling pipe right so we want to cool the kitchen To do, we're gonna need to adjust some things. <clears throat> Let's just adjust this one like that, and then we'll put this one like this. Um, then we're gonna need to do the same thing. Because we're gonna need to come back down. So we've got we put that there. <clears throat> Just we're going to come through the farms next. So let's put that one there as well. Yeah. Now, these I can probably just get away with a regular old granite, a regular pipe. With just a thermal reactive sedimentary
These are the only ones I want to cool. Do that. Do that, and then we can bring it over into our power area. Just trying to decide here where I want things. We're going to do that. <clears throat> and there we go. <laughs> Use the very last of our stuff. <coughs> okay, of course, we'll have to put these in. We just need a little more proper stone. All right, let's, um, we're being a little slow with our deconstruction. Here, let's get that done, guys. Okay. All right, very good, very good. All right. <clears throat> How's our decor looking? Look at this. We've got this entire section all green. These are green because of the plants, but as they get cleaned up, they'll get better as well. Um, and as we get this stuff in place, so... Perfect. <clears throat> That's really good. Uh, now we just need to kind of um, get some things done, some more stuff done, which, I mean, we are getting. Okay, so we can dig these out <clears throat> and then build these here and just kind of move along as we build some of this. And that'll give us more of our igneous rock we need to finish the pipe so not a problem <clears throat> and then we can get our critter ranching and switch you to critter ranching and on the priorities um we are going to put ranching higher but we're going to leave you on farming as well because there's a lot of farming and there's only one ranch so <clears throat> that will get our Hatches moved to where they need to be so that they are happier. This room is getting larger as we go. Um, can't build that yet until I get rid of this. I don't know if I can uproot this from here, but we'll try. Try to uproot those. <clears throat> We're going to do a little extra prioritization and getting some stuff done and power through some stuff. Now, as we are getting the base finalized as well, I want to start reducing the priorities on some things because, you know, we were we had high priorities on a lot of stuff, and so I want to start reducing all of this down. Like, I don't know why a table has a priority, to be honest. Yeah, I'm not sure on that. Uh, but we can... We can start doing some of that. touch those really until I well I can take off construction but instead of do all but then I gotta do a lot of other stuff so we'll just wait till we get things done but we'll start doing that as well to clean things up and everything oh yeah we should have a refined carbon now to put in this thing don't we um <laughs> there we go Here soon we'll be able to start putting in the automation. We just got to get there. 
with the skill set. All right, so. Let's go ahead and get these done. Let's prioritize. <coughs> I got to remember I'm turning this up, but let's let's do that. Get these as well. Unfortunately, a lot of plants to uproot. We do want a pinch of pepper farm. Because that is used in our high quality food, which we're going to want later. Alright, let me... Um... So right now we have six critters. So these guys are probably feeling cramped. Oh, well, amazingly, they're not. <clears throat> 86 tiles. Okay, well that's good. We don't need the cramped critters. They'll be unhappy. Let me dig that one out. Yeah, I don't know if we can get to this to uproot it. So we're going to have to be tricky here about how we might be able to do that to get to get this out of here. Hmm. We could come in from the bottom and do this tile. That's the way to do it. We can come in through here. Let's, let's hold off on that one so until we build this one. And then we can build this tile, which will uproot that, which will allow us to build our tiles there. All right, that's the way we'll do it. Perfect. Ah, see, we can be smart about this. Um, and we can finish our piping now. So we need a bridge here. Um, I still got to put that in. We need that bridge there. These bridges are not done yet, so we can't do those. <clears throat> and we need to put that like that, which used up all of our iron, so we'll have to start smashing out iron again. And we're going to need a little, some more copper, so... Eventually, I think I'm going to move this machine, too, because it's generating heat right here. Not a lot, but a little bit. <coughs> so we'll move it down. Food's looking better and better. 78,000. That is good. I haven't turned off any of the other consumables, and I'm not going to yet, but I will wait. So here's a question. Do we want to take anyone else? Let me see. We can get a cook or a cook. I mean, I'll wait until I get someone that has... I mean, tidying's good, but I need the supply strength and tidying. So we'll hold off. I think that's the next one to get, is we will get a second supplier cleaner. That way we can keep up with everything. And then, or a second farmer. Those are the two that we're going to take on. <clears throat> Alright, excellent. You have dug all the way over here. That means we can build these. Uh, <clears throat> we have also built these, so I can take and deconstruct those. Let's not deconstruct those yet. Only because I want to build that first. And we can go ahead and get those built. Perfect. Now, I believe we have a bleach stone here. Let's sweep this on a high. <clears throat> that will allow us our fifth toilet. Research is 
done. Now, I don't want to put the radioactive research inside here. We're going to have to do a separate location for that. Um, so, but we will be putting, like, the planetarium thing inside there. We can do that. Let's go ahead and get these two, just so that we have it. I don't think there's any salt water or petroleum yet. <laughs> but we will need the air system, so let's get that done next. Alright, and then over here, we need a couple things, because we can't reach any of this, I just realized. There we go. All right, and then, as I said, in the next episode, we're going to prioritize some construction. So, <laughs> making good progress. Our hatch farm is almost complete in size. We are getting close, and we will continue. See you in the next episode, everybody. Take care.